Hello everyone and welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. Today I'm here in the New England mountains, the Call of the Wild brand new map. I've been exploring, doing some of the story missions and so far the map is really pretty. It doesn't really offer anything new in terms of animals, but the landscapes are extremely nice looking and the map is quite tense and it reminds me of Hirschfelden which is my favorite map of all times and today I have a really good plan what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna go and follow this river all the way and get to this outpost that is on the west side over here and I'm gonna go slow and I'm gonna do just purely bow hunting nothing else I'm gonna see what I'm gonna find what I'm gonna find crawl through the bushes and do what I love the most about this game and I also want to mention that Virtual Hunter, our virtual reality hunting simulator, is currently on sale in Steam Winter Sale throughout the holidays. So if you have PC VR and you want to have an immersive hunting experience, Virtual Hunter is definitely the game for you. I'm the lead designer in the project and I would highly appreciate if you could take a look and share it with your friends and family who might have interest in VR hunting. Thank you so much and let's get to the hunt. Oh, there we go. There's a first herd of whitetail just drinking there. We have one, two bucks there. So I'm gonna, the wind is pretty bad, so I'm gonna try and circle the wind and get closer to them. This tree should hide me really well. It does not, but that doesn't seem to matter. So there is one buck and I saw a bigger one right next to it, but it's hidden that I can't see. That guy is a bit smaller. But this guy's giving me a perfect broadside. There's no shot on the other guy. It's somewhere be be between the trees. So this guy, 40 meters. Just a normal shot. I don't think there's gonna be too much trouble. This branch is slightly in front of me. But let's see. Oh, straight down. <laughs> and the rest of the herd is fleeing. I'm... Okay, there's the bigger buck. Okay, I'm gonna go... A bit closer since these guys are gonna now run away and they should come back. Let's see what I have. Come on. There we go. 20 meters. That's the biggest bug of the herd. I'm not gonna take with the AR nor the shotgun. Let's take back the bow. Just a simple shot shouldn't be too difficult to take. And down he goes. <laughs> oh, jeez. Come on, lady. <laughs> I'm not trying to hide here. <laughs> okay, let's go pick these guys up. This small river is extremely beautiful. Like, probably my favorite part of the whole map. And let's take a look at this new white tail model that they have made. That is pretty much perfect shot. Both lungs and a heart. So that's awesome. And here we have the bigger guy. Just missed the heart. If it had had his head up, it would have been perfect shot. But I really like this new model. It's not. It's really subtle changes that they did, but it really adds up quite a bit. It's really good looking model now. High pheasant and high big moose. I do have 600 grain arrows. I already put them on. It's 25 meters just crossing the river. He should notice that I'm here. But there's a cow going in the back. Hello. <laughs> oh, that's a hard shot. <laughs> Since that, that's a new change that they did for the moose, they, did, they will not die right away from a hard shot. I think that's awesome. So let's... Hello, lady. I'm gonna go. Oh, that's a good hard shot. <laughs> Two hard shots in a row. Okay, let's pick up this big guy. Just just perfect hard shot. Just through the heart and do the stomach. Let's pick this lady up. And here we go. Oh! Oh no, she went aggressive and I killed her before she could. Dang it. I haven't had the moose go aggressive on me just yet, so I really want to experience that. Look at that. She went pure aggressive and I just <laughs> shot her through the heart before she could do anything. Poor moose. Hello. 
Well, that's something that I'm gonna go after. Just try and call this guy in. I see paddles. Come on. There we go. It's another level 3. It's not a big guy. I have this other guy over here. I've been calling him in. I can see his nose peeking behind the tree. Can you just step up so I know? Okay, that's a small guy. Definitely gonna try and get this other guy first. Slightly bigger. It's just a level 3, so it's nothing huge, but he's coming. Um, this other small guy is... Ooh, he has different antlers on both sides. He's just running here, so I might as well take him down. I don't think he's gonna spook the other guy, who is still a bit further away. So it should be okay right there. Excuse me, what? Did... what? Did I just miss it from 30 meters completely? The wind is not that bad. I don't think the wind swayed it too much. I'm not gonna worry about it too much, but I have heard people are shooting blanks. So is that affecting bows? Who knows? It might be the issue. So this guy is just slowly coming in, 30 something meters. Hi. Hello. I am here, can you take a look? Have an arrow! Ooh! <laughs> ah. Another hard shot! Call him mid yelling! Yeah, let's pick him up. Look at that pose. He was yelling at me. And I shot him straight through the heart. This new harvest screen is otherwise great. But the light is coming from top and sometimes like in here. The light is really not good on the most face. It gets it, it makes really harsh shadows under and it's not that good looking in that sense. I have another moose inside. This river is awesome. Like really slow hunting like this. I really really enjoy this river part. It it has enough view that you can see in front of you. But it's not big view enough that you can just run and gun down animals constantly. Well, what? He's just... Wait, what? How? What? I'm perfectly hidden in a bush. The wind is not too bad. And I have deodorant. And this guy just bolted out of, way, out of, out of here. I can hear something walking around. What is it? Oh, it's a cow moose. Hi. Do you want to step out so I can point you with an arrow? I can see it. I can hear you. Come on. But man, I really wonder what happened to that moose. How did it know I'm here? Okay, there it is. Shouldn't be too hard. Should be like 30 meters or so. Come on. Got it. At least I hit it, did I? Oh yeah, it's going down. That's at least a single lung. Should penetrate further. Stomach, liver, maybe. And here she is. Single lung, stomach, intestines, liver. <laughs> Straight through the moose. The 600 grain arrows are really OP, OP. Um, I have another male moose calling. That might be the level 3. So I'm gonna go check it out. There he is, 50 meters, coming a bit closer. He's still alert, how is Okay, he's in the wind. I really have to be fast here. Okay. Can you turn back so I can shoot you? Pretty please. There we go. Should be right somewhere there. Got it. <laughs> Is that like 4th or 5th hard shot moose? <laughs> Almost in a row. Man, that's awesome. Oh, 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 oh. Dang it. That's a big boy. It's a level 4. Look at that pose. Straight through the heart. Heart left fibula. Perfect hard shot. From over 50 meters. Man, I really... Man, I'm really feeling the bow today. 
my shots are just landing exactly where I'm aiming them. And this has been an awesome hunt so far. Okay, I have another group of moose that's drinking. Two really small level trees. But I'm gonna try and get closer. Just crawl around. Get them a bit to the broad side. These guys are in a bit in the push bushes, so I really want to get better shot at them. 42 meters to the first one. Pretty simple shot. The wind is also really good. So they should have no idea that I am here. Yeah, that's a long. It's the second one. Okay, the second one is already fleeing. So I really just want to do the same thing again. So I'm just gonna crawl a bit closer and wait for them to come back to the zone. I don't think they'll have any issues to coming back. There we go. Took them a couple minutes, but they are back. That's a nice picture to take. So I have this bull, 45 meters. And then the cow a bit further away. I'm gonna take this guy down. 45 meters, not too hard. Just stop shaking so I don't hit your antlers. There we go. That's a double lung. And down he goes. <laughs> oh jeez, what? Sorry for disturbing your sleep, Mr. Whitetail. <laughs> scared the crap out of me. Let's pick this guy up. The double lung shot. Just barely missed the heart. That's like two centimeters. And I would have got it. But like, look at this map. Overall, I'm feeling that the map is really good for slow paced hunting, like bow hunting. And the landscapes really are looking fantastic. Like look down there. The river especially looks great. I've been enjoying the map tremendously so far. Okay, that's just a stand. I don't really care about it. Let's head back to the river. Continue our hunt. Let's pick this guy up too. That's also perfect double lung shot. And also barely missed the heart. Man. I really am feeling the heart shots today. Ooh. There's another, that's a level 4. Okay, that's a big boy. That's a pretty weird spot, so I have to pick the circle. Should be right there. There he is, scratching his nose. <laughs> 40 meters. Gonna get a bit closer. So I can have a proper shot at him. So here we are. 33 meters. How in the world does he know I'm here? Hi. Okay. Turning away. Going back uphill. You can turn. So I can take a shot. Dang it. How is he knowing that I am here? I crawled the whole way. And he knows that I'm here. The wind is not bad at all. He's at 40 meters. He's just standing around. He went back to calm. And there's another moose here. If he's not moving, I actually have the perfect chance to try to uh, take a hard shot. <laughs> See, if I shoot straight through from here, I should catch a heart. I'm gonna do something stupid here. I'm just gonna go for it. 40 meters, if I shoot through the butt, I have a high chance of getting Texas hard shot. <laughs> I've never done it, and I really want to do it, so <laughs> let's give this a shot. Come on. You kidding me? <laughs> I got it. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. <laughs> Texas hard shot <laughs> on the moon <laughs> from 40 meters with a bow. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> that actually worked out. I, I actually did it. <laughs> oh man, there he goes. Down he went straight away. That's 100% a hard shot. 
<laughs> from behind. <laughs> That's ridiculous. That has to be one of my top bow shots of all time. You died in such a stupid spot. Let's just see. Man, he looks awesome though. I really like this, this antler type. It's a gold. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Perfect Texas <laughs> heart shot. Went through the butt, intestines, stomach, liver, and between the lungs, through the heart. Holy crap, guys. <laughs> I didn't even hit the lungs. It went perfectly between the lungs. That's amazing. That has to be one of my best shots of all time. <laughs> I really challenge any of you, <laughs> you to do the same. But that was awesome. Just perfect opportunity too. It was big, high. His front was a bit high, so I could actually hit the heart from above. The angle is perfect. Look at that. Perfect. Absolutely perfect shot. It wouldn't have been any more perfect. <laughs> Golden Texas Hearts at most. I challenge any of you guys to do better. <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> well, I'm so happy. That was awesome. <laughs> this made my whole hunt. That was amazing. Holy crap, that was amazing. Top moments of my Call of the Wild career. Right after my... And diamond red deer with the recur after hunting it for one and a half months. Alright. That actually covers this river spot with the bow. I had really fun. This felt really like genuine hunt this time. The map really doesn't offer you anything new in terms of animals. And if you really like the slower paced hunting, this map has a lot to offer. If you like Hirschfelden, I really feel like you are gonna enjoy this map too. It's it's dense, it's more challenging, and it's not really for grinding because a lot of the waterways are just this river, and the river is pretty covered. But there is still a lot of animals in here. That has been... I had most fun with this hunt so far in this map, and it's been really fun overall in this map. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching, and as always... Have fun, happy hunting, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.